Well, I'm welcoming you to this morning update right here on The Buzz UG. My name is Melad Milo, a.k.a. Fuller, and uh, subscribe in case you haven't, and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, President Museveni's son, Jeno Mohozi Kanerugaba, has revealed that he's behind the M23 rebel group that is killing citizens and terrorizing in the Democratic Republic of Congo. As for M23, I think it's very, very dangerous for anybody to fight those brothers of ours. They are not terrorists. They are fighting for the rights of Tusi in DRC. Well, that is a statement coming from Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba, the former chief of land forces right here in Uganda. Now, recently, the members of parliament in DRC and uh, members of the public accused Uganda of supporting the M23 rebels and tasked their president, Felix Tshisekedi, to cut ties with Uganda. However, the deputy spokesperson of UPDF, Deo Akiki, came out and refuted the allegation by the DRC parliament. And many times, the government of Uganda has denied being in support of the M23 rebels. But now, Jenom Hozi Kanerugaba's statements contradicts the official position of the government of Uganda on this M23 rebel group. Well, I don't know what you think about this story, but in case you have anything on your mind, just put it down in the comment section. Well, in other news... A Ugandan pilot, Jackson Nisima, and a Russian, whose names are yet to be identified, have died in a Goma express plane that crashed in the DRC. This express plane has been missing for some days, but it had crashed in one of the forests in the DRC, and two people on board have been confirmed dead. It is reported that the unpleasant weather could be the cause of this accident. May their souls rest in peace. Now, relatedly, 19 people have been confirmed dead in a precision airplane crash in Lake Victoria yesterday. Captain Rubaga, the chief pilot in this company, and uh, his co-pilot, Peter Omondi, also died in this terrible accident. And guess what? Captain Rubaga was scheduled to retire next year. Oh, this is so bad. May their souls rest in peace. <laughs> And finally, this is coming in from the entertainment industry. Rema Namakula has finally revealed her baby Alia's face on her birthday today. Ever since Rema gave birth last year, no one knew her baby's face apart from her family members. And today, on her baby's birthday, she decided to put her face out there for all people to wish her a happy birthday and appreciate her beauty. And I must confess that Rema Namakula gives birth to beautiful babies. Look at this soul. Oh my goodness. And also look at Amal, Eddie Kenzo's daughter. Very beautiful. Congratulations and happy birthday to baby Alia. There you go. That is the latest update I have for you right now on The Buzz UG. And uh, in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, a.k.a. Fuller. It's a bye for now. Thank you. Oh, yeah.